Be sure to refresh this channel multiple times each day for the hottest and latest WWE news and rumors. Like and subscribe. Nuclear heat is going around online right now as it concerns one Tessa Blanchard. Ladies and gentlemen, remember to share, subscribe. When I tell you to refresh my channel numerous times a day, multiple times a day, I mean that from the bottom of my heart because we're going to give you ongoing rumors and news on YouTube in video form, whether it be a regular upload or a live stream. Viewers, we're going to jump right into this and make sure to give your opinions and your comments because this channel is run on fan interaction, fan participation. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and smash that bell. And remember, tune in to show and view each and every day, numerous times a day, because again, viewers, can't stress this enough, I will be providing content around the clock that I'll never, ever stop. So, wow. Superheroes, the wild woman of wrestling. Uh, stand back. She's nuclear. Get your new Tessa Blanchard t-shirt exclusively on PWTs right now. Now, this was on this was Thursday afternoon that this t-shirt was released by ProWrestlingTees.com. Um, now, they tweeted this out. It's on Twitter. It's on social media. So, the tweet ended up being ratioed with more quote retweets than likes with fans bringing up the past accusations, controversies, conflicts made towards uh, Tessa's uh, bullying and racism. And of course, there's uh, tweets and reactions to the t-shirt. Some of the people saying, oh, so you're all doubling down on the racism and the bullying, huh? Uh, rejected shirt prints. Not sorry. Y'all mad. I'm going to head south. Toxic. Radioactive heat. I'm going to keep it real. My N-word. Uh, advertising your cornerstone star as toxic and damaging to everything she touches is certainly a bold strategy. Let's see how this plays out for them. So, you're marketing her as a, yeah, you know she's a racist pass, but we don't care. Run me the receipts of who buys this shirt. It's not nuclear. It's ne negligent. Uh, and that is to a list of her favorite N-words. Add that to the list of her favorite N-words. I'm sorry. Should have been on this. Disgusting. Negligent. Excuse me. Uh, <clears throat> another person said, uh, what a terrible t-shirt. Also, Way to uh, trivialize her piece of shit behavior. Uh, I don't think that's the. I don't think that's quite the apology she should be making right now. So, um, and again, viewers, sorry for the botches and bloopers on that. Uh, I was pronunciating. I was pronunciating. You know, from that movie Chuck and Larry. I was pronunciating. Anyways, some words I can't pronounce. Though, you know, it's you know, there's many videos on me online about this, that, and the other. But ladies and gentlemen, Tessa Blanchard, she's a great talent. She's got a great body, but her attitude, uh, well, some could say that her attitude. And listen, I mean, we all know what, what, what the debacle that went down with Hulk Hogan. We all know the conflicts, the controversies. And if anything, you know what? Now she's, Tessa Blanche is probably going to take this and, and, and run with it. And again, you know, this new wrestling entity, oh, they're trying to revive it. They're trying to rebrand it. They're trying to restart it. Kind of like I'm trying to restart my channel with ongoing rumors and news. Guys, this is obviously a hot topic, a hot debate. Uh, again, backlash over this new T-shirt. And, uh, you know, see, back in the day, had this been the 90s or the 80s, I mean, the heat would have been extreme. You know, there was no online. There was no Internet. You know, times have changed. And, you know, I don't stand up for people that, you know, again, I don't care if you're wh white, black, high, bi, single in a religion, gay, um, lord. Um, I, it doesn't matter what you are. It doesn't matter. But uh, obviously, you know, she's made her mistakes. She's made her blunders. You know what I'm saying? And she's getting a lot of heel heat. And I, but I don't know if it's the kind of heat you want to ask for. I don't know if it's the kind of heat that you want to look for. Um, some would say that she's crossed the line. And uh, she's definitely got a storied past. But here's the thing. She's getting people talking. She's getting people to make a reaction. And that's what it's all about at the end of the day, right? A reaction. Now, some could say that, you know, getting a reaction is a good thing. But some could say that uh, you're getting a reaction for all the bad things. And maybe it's uh, a reaction for all the negatives and, you know, and all the things that she has done in her past. And again, viewers, you know, I I've heard about it. You know what I'm saying? I've heard about this online. You know, and, you know, listen. This is one of those subjects that it's, you know, it's kind of hard to put your finger on. It's it's, it's kind of hard to get your word out about it. It's, it's kind of hard to. Uh, we got to deviate from the script, okay? We, we got to deviate from the script. You know, Tessa Blanchard, you know, no matter what she has done, no matter what she has accomplished, this whole racism and all this backlash is really overtaking anything she's ever done or accomplished uh, in the world of professional wrestling. And you know what? I, you know, again, 
I'm sure she'll be the first to admit that. Sure. She's done her wrongdoings. She has her issues. She's, you know, but maybe is this part of a gimmick or is this really her? Is this what she's really all about? Um, you know, bullying, um, you know, just, <clears throat> I mean, the backlash about a T-shirt. But again, I mean, she's 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 made her bed, so I guess she's lying in it. Um, but, you know, the tweet ended up being ratioed with more quote retweets than likes. And again, with fans bringing up uh, past accusations about her of her bullying. So she's done bullying. She's done racism. Uh, that's what I'm reading online. That's what I'm reading on the dirt sheets and the websites. But like I said, this is this is an uncomfortable topic. I mean, my viewers, my fans, my subscribers messaged me on my Facebook fan page, and they said, "Hey, Sean, what do you think about this? We we want your opinion." And this and if this video is viewed only by seven people, well, at least you know I'm here to give my view and my opinion. But I don't want to I don't want to catch nuclear heat. I already got enough of my own nuclear heat on this website with all kinds of people coming on YouTube trying to expose me like that hasn't been done a thousand times. People trying to do rants on me like that hasn't been done a million times. People trying to cut uh, promos on me and and uh, just just trying to bury me and all this other crap and now Tess, Tessa Blanchard obviously uh, is, is getting buried too uh, with this new t-shirt and you gotta wonder now is this going is this going to be the thing that if she was going to be the cornerstone of this wrestling company you gotta wonder is this going to be the thing that makes her get fired or fined or uh or will she go to the back of the ladder will she go to the back of the line uh will 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 she um branch out or is social media going to get the best of a superstar again or is Tessa Blanchard going to take this and run with it and become one of the biggest heels of all time? Again, whether good, bad, happy, or sad, or indifferent. Again, whether it's for the right reasons or the wrong reasons, and there's probably a lot of wrong reasons here. <clears throat> the fact of the matter is, is Tessa Blanchard um, is on fire right now, but is, is it a dumpster fire or is it a real fire? Uh, that's that's the thing, viewers. Whatever way, are you a fan of Tessa Blanchard? Do you, what do you think of her past the acquisition? Again, the, I I don't have the evidence and the proof here. I'm just reading online through tweets and social media and Facebook and uh, past matchups and past companies. And, you know, I'm, I'm just reading through different things here. And, you know, it, right now, it, sure, does it look good? No, it, it doesn't look too good. It, it doesn't look too good. It doesn't look too impressive. But, you know, you know when push comes to shove, uh, you know, Will we forgive and forget, or can we just forget and forgive, um, or forgive and forget? I I don't know. This is this is um, yeah. And I don't want to, you know, I don't want to stir the pot here. You know what I'm saying? I've done enough stirring the pot on YouTube since 2012. But ladies and gentlemen, no, your your comments, your opinions. Share, subscribe, remember to join Show and View each and every day for the hottest and latest WWE numerous times a day in video form on YouTube. Subscribe.